거죠. 응, 돌이 뭐야? 바깥 문 떠, 그냥 문 나가, 삼 나가, 기어 문 떠, 돈이. 응, 그냥 문 좀, 로 비트 가, 돌, 남 낭, 사브리냐, 그냥 문 떠, 가, 왕 한, 아이 가사, 레 클론, 미어 문 넣어, 낫네, 집어 먹고, 응, 그냥 문 떠, 삼 라, 프로 봇, 프로 봇, 박, 고, 문이 가, 문 기, 삼 쩡. Thank you, Mr. President. I will be a, a fairly brief this afternoon uh, before we turn the floor over to the civil party uh, lawyers. Um, before I get to the uh, number of photographs that I would present, um, I would just observe in response to some of the objections that have been made um, that the reason that we presented the excerpts um, from IS 20.28 and IS 20.33, which were previous slides, have been um, were exactly as um, for the reason uh, that, uh, that uh, uh, was allowed uh, by your comments, uh, Mr. President, which is that in each of those cases, when the court reviews the record, uh, you will see that uh, the statements that were made by Noon Che back in these interviews are different uh, than what he has told this chamber. So it is, it is somewhat hard for us to present that uh, without contrasting the testimony given in court uh, to that which Noon Che has the statements he made back then. But in each case, uh, the reason uh, for the importance of those particular excerpts is because they show uh, a different description by Nunchea of either his role and responsibilities, but also a much more detailed account of the role of Ng Suri and Ku Santan, who seem to have become ghosts in Nunchea's testimony before this chamber, uh, and therefore we wanted to point out to the chamber uh, the, the references and discussion. That, that is the only reason, uh, that was the reason for the importance of those particular excerpts. Now, the, the document that I would like to uh, turn to is document D366-7-2. <coughs> this is a, a collection uh, of a number of photographs, um, quite a few photographs. Uh, I'm simply going to focus on four of them this afternoon, uh, four photographs that appear to come. Uh, include the same group of people from the same event. And I would refer the court uh, to what is page 20 of this document, or ERN 00442745. And I would ask uh, to show uh, that page on the screen. And I would note um, uh, that as we're going to be presenting photographs, uh, the photographs uh, uh, we will just be referring to the year-end page that actually contains the photographs. This is a, 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 a picture of a group of leaders, and you will see that in this document uh, the photos are somewhat blurry. Um, for that reason, um, I will also reference the court to uh, more clear copies of these photographs that are uh, part of the case file and some of them are actually already before the chamber. Uh, in this case uh, of this photograph, uh, this same photograph is before the chamber as E3 slash 136, which is case file number D313. .237. And I'd like to show that on the screen because the photograph is a little easier uh, to see uh, in, in, the, in, in that version of the document.
And as you can see, this is a photograph uh, of a significance of this photograph is that it is one of a group of four photographs of uh, top leaders uh, of the party. Um, starting uh, from the left side, uh, there is Tamak, there is Khoi Thun, next to him is Nun Chea, there is Von Vet, uh, in the middle, uh, the person is Ne Saran, Elias Ya, who was the secretary of the Northeast Zone uh, later on. There is Son Sen in the glasses towards the right, and at the very far right, standing, is Pol Pot. And sitting uh, a third, third in, uh, with the Krama around his neck, is Sao Pim. Another a photograph from the same location, and what appears to be the same day, uh, can be found uh, on in document D366-7.1.4, uh, which is at page uh, uh, 112 or ERN 0044287. And if I may first show uh, the uh, portion of that document, or the version of that document uh, that is contained uh, in document uh, D366-7.1.4.5, uh, again, uh, the reason this doc version is useful is because there is some uh, additional information that appears as to where these photographs came from. Um, uh, once again, there is a more clear version of this document that is already before the chamber uh, that I would like uh, to reference, which is document uh, D313 slash 1.2.236, uh, which is before the chamber as E3 slash 137. And if you want to show that on the screen now, again, this document includes some of the same people who were in the group photo shown, uh, only here uh, we see a podium uh, at which uh, Pol Pot is speaking and a number of the other leaders are seated on the stage towards the right of Pol Pot or the right of, of this picture uh, it appears that Mr. Noon Chea and Tamok are seated and over to the other side uh, at least one of the people um, appears to be South Pim. The third photograph uh, from this collection appears at page 19, ERN 0042744. And once again, if I may first show uh, the uh, version of the document that comes from D366 slash 7.1. And your honors will see that uh, this is a, a larger group photo uh, from the same event in which uh, a number of the participants have been identified. Uh, once again, uh, there is a version a clear version of this photograph uh, in the case file, which is document D313-1.4.1.5, if I may show that. Now, this particular photograph, uh, I will also point out uh, to the chamber, it is also contained in Philip Short's book, uh, Pol Pot, The History of a Nightmare, which is before the chamber as E3-9. You will find this photograph at, um, uh, in the photographs that appear across from page 129 of the book, which is here on page 0039633. Two eight. 
the photograph is identified by Philip Short as a photo of, quote, the CPK's third Congress held in the jungle near the Chinit River in 1971. And if we could go back to the photo uh, for, for a, uh, a short period, uh, a number of the same leaders are in this larger group photo, and including, uh, if we can zoom in a little bit into the top row towards the right, one can see Chu uh, Sampan uh, in the background, uh, two persons over uh, from Khoi uh, Chung. In addition, as uh, in the uh, uh, page 19 of indicated in the list of people uh, that I presented, in addition to Khoi Sam Pan, uh, uh, Yun and Nim were also present, uh, as well as the other leaders uh, that we've previously seen. Uh, Pol Pot, Khoi Tun, uh, Sao Pim, and others. Now, in this particular version of the photograph, uh, uh, it is somewhat cut off on the, on the very right edge, uh, and so one cannot see uh, Mr. Nun Che in this photograph. But if we turn uh, to uh, the last photograph from this group, um, which is found on page uh, 21 of D366 slash 7.1.415, and it is at year end 0044274476. Once again, I will first show the page that appears in the larger document. And again, uh, this photo, a, uh, a clear version of this photo, may be found in document D313 slash 1.2.234. And in this version of the photograph, uh, you can see by comparing it to the last one, it is the same group of people. Uh, Kusum Pan is in the same location. Uh, but if we scroll towards the right side of this photograph, uh, you, you will be able to see Nguyen Chea standing at the very uh, far right uh, with the around his neck. So we present these three series of photographs as they've been identified uh, by Philip Short as coming from the 1971 Party Congress. They are obviously significant because they show the leaders and persons who were present. Now, instead, um, because some of the accused also are not here, in particular Nguyen Chea, um, uh, when we were examining Nguyen Chea, uh, we showed on the screen uh, two of these documents. Um, and I was told by my colleagues that it was somewhat hard, harder to see the documents on the screen, uh, something I observed myself. So we printed out uh, four, the, uh, four copies uh, of these photographs that I've just presented. Uh, and I would simply ask uh, that uh, the chamber that they be submitted uh, to the Nguyen Chea defense, and I would request that if Nguyen Chea can identify any of the people, uh, that he do so uh, simply by uh, marking on the photographs. Um, if he want, wishes to instead to comment in court, that's also his option, but rather than present an opportunity for comments now, uh, I would suggest it's more productive that we give uh, to the counsel for the accused a copy of the photographs so that is, if this uh, client wishes to identify or comment on the photographs, they may. And I have the four photographs in the folder. So if I, when I'm requesting Mr. President is to, uh, through, the, through the court, to present these photographs to Nguyen Che as counsel, so that at his opportunity he can have a chance if he wishes to identify the people and submit it back to the chamber.
มนตรีรัฐบาลตลาดกายกไอกษารูปทอดปีดำนางทางปริญญาอันตรายที่จูนเดิมทวีกาเปียกระไดบลุกนุนจีขอบคุณคุณผู้ชมขอเสนอให้ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูลและขอบคุณที่ได้รับข้อมูล I'm happy to provide uh, them to Kew Sampan's counsel as well. I uh, just simply ask that he let me know and I will provide them to him in case he wishes to comment on the photographs as well. That, that is uh, the end of the documents uh, that we have to present uh, today. Um, again, we've been fairly brief with me and Chea because I covered uh, for a number of the documents either in our examination of him and also in the Thursday, Thursday afternoon session. And uh, a lot of the policy related documents were also presented by our colleagues on, on Monday morning. So we would end our presentations there and uh, uh, turn the floor to the civil party lawyers. អរបស់សូមអរគុណលោកវិធានសូមគ្រប់គ្រប់ប្រឹក្សាជំនុំជម្រះអឺឆ្លើយតបទៅនឹងសម្ដីរបស់ ដែលលោកសហព្រះញ្ញាបានលើកអំបាញ់មិញថាលោកនឹងមិនធ្វើការឆ្លើយតបនៅក្នុងការដេញដោលនេះទេដូច្នេះខ្ញុំបាទក
จมตัวระบาดโลกเมตตาบีกาเปียกระไดเคือสมพรสมเชยลูกตรายเมตตาบีนอมกดมนางดาวมดังรับรับวินี้เมตตาบีเอลิซาเบธ Oui, Monsieur le Président, nous avons déposé notre liste et avons fait circuler à toutes les parties. Et nous avons effectivement sur notre liste des constitutions de participants. Il ne s'agit pas de nouvelles pièces. Il s'agit de pièces que nous avons déposées au mois d'avril auprès de la Chambre. Ce sont les premières constitutions et toutes ces parties civiles sont évidemment d'ores et déjà reçues par les juges d'instruction. Chambre préliminaire. Leur constitution et leur recevabilité ne sont donc plus en question. Ça c'est un point. L'autre point, c'est que s'il doit y avoir un débat sur ces déposés, ces déclarations de parties civiles, je souhaiterais pouvoir développer un certain nombre d'arguments. En toute hypothèse, en ce qui concerne la traduction, c'est le premier point qui a été évoqué aujourd'hui. Je souhaiterais rappeler. Ce que la Chambre a indiqué à son audience en janvier, puisque nous avons eu un premier petit débat sur le sujet. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait indiqué que nous ne pouvions pas utiliser ces documents si nous ne les avions pas au moins avant le mois de janvier. Et la Chambre nous avait que la charge de travail de l'unité de traduction avait empêché. J'indique d'ores et déjà à la Chambre que nous avons fait des demandes de traduction de ces dépositions qui sont pour l'essentiel en Khmer. Certaines sont en français, certaines sont en anglais, mais celles en français et en anglais ont été traduites en Khmer. Donc elles sont déjà en anglais. Celles en Khmer que nous allons produire, nous avons demandé une traduction à l'unité de traduction, nous avons demandé 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 à l'unité de traduction, Lorsque nous avons présenté ces documents, Donc, nous nous sommes assurés que nous pourrions avoir une traduction. Nous aurons une traduction de langue pour certains, mais peut-être pas pour tous, ici, demain matin, ou demain, en fin de matinée, ou demain, en début d'après-midi, d'ailleurs, parce que je note que nous avons 45 minutes de moins pour le moment de ce qui était prévu cet après-midi. Voilà les premières observations que je souhaitais faire. Si la Chambre m'autorise à développer davantage sur ce sujet, je peux le faire, et notamment sur l'utilité de ces premières déclarations et constitutions civiles, et aussi sur le fait que nous sommes dans une situation de jurisprudence tout à fait particulière ici, puisque en jurisprudence internationale, il n'y a pas de partie civile, et que ce que nous souhaitons utiliser, c'est dans une situation particulière, c'est une des chambres extraordinaires. J'ajoute que ces déclarations sont évidemment extrêmement importantes. Ce sont celles de parties civiles, c'est-à-dire de victimes, dont l'importance a été retenue suffisamment par les juges d'instruction et la chambre préliminaire, et qui apportent précisément, en l'occurrence, celles que nous souhaitons produire sont uniquement sur le contexte historique, et elles visent évidemment à apporter des précisions qui sont importantes de notre point de vue. Voilà ce que je souhaitais vous préciser. ແລະបងប្អូនទីមួយគឺសូមចេញលោកមេត្តវីបាទសូមអរគុណលោកប្រធានខ្ញុំបាទសូមបញ្ជាក់ថាដោយនៅក្នុងបញ្ជីនេះ
cô đau này cả bằng hai ai cả xa nửa bên này cứ đầm bay bằng hai nhầm pi bằng chi đại xa xây bà bị đại ai cả xa tiền lái đại ai đại phía kia ai dục bằng hai chun xa thiền nát chun ở bây ở triệu mình men chia cô ca này ca tổ tuôn dục chia họ tàng rồi thế bài thà cả đại cả xa nửa bên này cứ nông tự đào muối chun đào xa thiền nát chun mình men sầm rạp ao ăn chấm đông chấm rẻ dục ai cả xa tiền ăn nô phơi chia họ tàng rồi thế vì thế này ca dục xạ xây chấm lai xạ xây rư cò chấm lai rồi bỏ đa mình đăng rạp bảo vệ này chẳng lại na đa mình biết được nông sản nông riêng này cứ thà dương nhâm sôm chấm to hai sôm ao cầm bút xa chấm đông chấm rẻ mệt ta bắt để sai cầm ao mệt thu vi đa mình đăng rạp bảo vệ đi bằng hải và sôm ao cồn bà ao cồn thì mối cứ ao nhâm rẻ mong cầu từ một trại rạp bảo vệ lá cá do sản nông rụp thọt vì đồng nàng thập địa nhà anh đã chết do từ protocol chun đal medivi chết cả việc đây ơi lục khiu sầm phòn tam cả đại quật dự lục rôm từ tua do từ vị nết tam sầm nở rồi bỏ đồng nàng thập địa nhà anh đã chết
Ouais. ពុះបញ្ហាដែលចំទោះរបស់លោកមេធាវីកាពីក្តីនេះគឺសម្ភោនទៅនឹងមិនជីឯកសារដែលប៉ុនប៉ងទៅនឹងកដៈចំពោះ
ថ្ងៃស្អែកថ្ងៃពុទ្ធទី